Hey guys, welcome to Campbell Workshop. Today we're making a paper field flower, straw flowers. The outcome doesn't just look like it, but also feels like it. Before we start, if you haven't subscribed to our channel, don't forget to click on the subscribe button below so you won't miss any of our new tutorials. We need 4 strips of beige crepe paper as the flower centre. For the 2cm paper strips, we need to colour the tip with some yellow. Do the same on both sides. Cut the tip into small fringes. Wrap a piece of 20cm 18 gauge wire with green flower tape and bend a loop on the top. Then we wrap the 1.5cm beige crepe paper to the wire with some hot glue. Add a bit of hot glue to support the bottom and wrap the 2cm paper strip to the center. Make sure the bottom of the paper matches the bottom of the flower center. Expand the yellow fringes and add a bit of yellow to the beige flower center. Only color the surrounding and leave the center clear. It should look like this. Trim two pieces of 10 cm long paper strips with the height of each petal template. Fold the paper strip according to the template and clip it together with a paper clip. It will be much easier to cut the petals out. It will take a bit of time but it's worth to get the detailed cuttings. Next, colouring. Take out some yellow and red. The inner layer, which is the shortest template, need to be coloured in yellow with a tint of red. For the second layer, we need to colour the paper with a bit more red, which is similar to a light orange. Last but not least, the last layer we are going to colour with a darker orange. So the flower has a graduation of colours. And don't forget to colour both sides. Now we move on to the shaping. Use the end of the paintbrush to help you to curl the petals and gather the petals together with a tweezer and fold at the bottom so the petals will stay in its position. Do the same to all of the petals and we can start attaching the petals to the flower centre from the smallest to the biggest and back to the smallest layer by layer. We need about 5 layers. You can trim the petals into the smaller segments to get a better control. It should look like this. When your flower is ready, we will also need to add some bottom leaves to hide the glue. Cut the green leaves according to the template. You can use the scrap paper in this step. Simply attach the bottom leaves with some Yuhu glue to the flower.
Then we also need some leaves for the whole branch and put them aside for later. Now we move on to the budding flowers. Wrap the 18 gauge wire with some flower tape and bend a loop on the top. Cut a piece of 1.5x10 cm beige crepe paper as the flower center and wrap it around the loop. Then for the first two layers, we take out the smallest curled petals and fold the petals inwards, which is the opposite of the opening flowers. For the third and fourth layer, we are going to add the petals like the open flower. The flower will look like half open. We also need to add some bottom leaves to the budding flower. The budding flower should look like this. Grab a bit of flower tape to hide the root of the bottom leaves. Then we can start adding the flowers, leaves, the budding flowers together. And we are done. Thank you for watching the video and I hope you like it. We have noticed 80% of our audience is not subscribed yet. If you like it, please don't forget to like, comment and subscribe to our channel. It will really help our channel to grow. Stay tuned for our weekly tutorials. And all our templates are available on our Etsy store. Check them out as well. See you guys next week.